Thanks for joining us on another one of Rich and Jen's Adventures. We live in the Pigeon Forge, Gatlinburg area, and we review local restaurants and things to do in our area. We also travel and do campground reviews and travel videos. We love biking, jeeping, riding our scooters, and we always bring our Yorkies, Bella and Benson. So if you're ready, let's go. Hey, and welcome to another one of Rich and Jen's Adventures. Today, we're checking out a new restaurant that just opened up down the road from us, and it's called La Patrona. So we're gonna go in and check it out and let you know what we think. Are you ready, Rich? I'm ready. All right, let's go. Let's go and check it out. They got some nice outside seating here. If it's not too hot. It's a little warm today. Well, Jim, what you got here? Ooh, they just brought chips and salsa and some drinks for us. I've been waiting. I'm gonna try the salsa. It looks really good. Mmm, that is fresh and a little spicy, but good spicy. Not like burn your mouth, but it's got a nice kick to it. So they have a lot of really good stuff on the menu. I can't decide, I might get the chimichangas, I might get the loaded nachos. They also have fajitas, which looks really good. Tacos, they got a lot of really good looking stuff in there, so. All right, well, I'm gonna look at the menu and I'll let you know what I think. All right. All right, Rich, you looked at the menu, what are you gonna get? I think I'm gonna get the chimichangas. Oh, that sounded so good. Okay, well, I'm gonna get something different then. Are you gonna do Honduras or are you I gonna do No, It's really cool. Um, tell them about, they have the Honduran food here. They do, they do, it looks interesting. Yeah, they have a whole fish that they fry and they've got some kind of Honduran tacos. Um, it's gonna be really cool. So we'll check it out and uh, we'll uh, see what we come up with and show you what our food looks like in a few minutes. Sure. All right, Jen, what did you order? Well, I ordered the fajita nachos because it sounded really, really good. And as you can see, the chips and salsa <laughs> were really good. Yeah, they didn't make it too long. And what's something that's really neat here is they have something I haven't seen around here anywhere else, and that is a Honduran food, Honduras food. So we wanted to try that, so we got some Honduran-style tacos for an appetizer, and so we're going to check those out and see what we think. So this is something that might be really cool because it's a little different than everywhere else. Mm -hmm. Looking forward to it. This is a picture of the Tacos Catrechos. These were really good and these were the Honduras style tacos. So they were not what you would normally expect, but this is what they look like. Now Jen is about to go into her fajita nachos. There's so much stuff on here, I don't know where to start but I'm sure I can find a place. All right, we get some chicken on there, some cheese. Wow, that's got some crunch. Mmm. This is really good. All right, so Rich just got his. Yeah. Chicken, chimichanga, rice, guacamole, and beans. Ooh, that guacamole looks good. It does, it does. All right, you can dig in there and see what you think. Fantastic. Yeah, let me see what that looks like inside. It's got chicken, it's got a, a crust, it's a chimichanga. That's really good. Yeah, and then uh, try the beans. Those have like some kind of cheese on them, Mexican mm -hmm. cheese on them or something. How is it? It's really good. Mm -hmm. The Mine is absolutely delicious. I can't wait to dig into it. So, all right, we're gonna eat. So let's go. Here is our total bill for our meal. 
Well, we just finished up our dinner at La Patrona restaurant here in Sevierville, and let me tell you something, it was really good. Um, I have not been to a restaurant that had any Honduran food. This has Mexican as well as Honduran, and evidently the cooks in the back have only been here a few years from Honduras, and they uh, have a fantastic menu with a lot of choices and i had the fajita nachos they were fantastic the chicken was seasoned perfectly it was fresh you could tell it was authentic mexican food not like you know i would make with cheddar cheese and hamburger with you know taco bell seasoning on it it was the real deal and it was very good we wanted to try the honduran food too so we had these uh, honduran style tacos and I'm not sure how to pronounce the name, so <laughs> no I'm not way. even going to try. try. But they were outstanding. Yeah, they were good. It was different. Yes. It was had like liquid and coleslaw. It, it was, was just really, really good, though. Really good, um, though. No, yeah. it was good. Different, and but good. They also serve breakfast here, so we're going to come back and try breakfast. They're yeah. open from 9 a.m. until 10 p.m. every day. Um, they've been open for like a week, and that's it. Mm -hmm. So we were very impressed. There weren't many people in because we came at 3.30, and we do that on purpose so that our videos don't have tons of people, and we don't disturb people. We try not to while we're eating and talking. So, right. Rich, what did you think of your chimichangas? Uh, they were delicious. Uh, shout out to Abel. Uh, fantastic young man. Um, yes. He helped us pronouncing the uh, Honduran tacos. <laughs> and another thing, guys, uh, it's this 4th of July weekend. It is a zoo in Pigeon Fort Gatlinburg. And uh, this was fantastic. It just right off Boyd's Creek Highway. It's, uh, yes. Um, and it was quiet. It's nice and quiet out here. Um, this is where I'd be. <laughs> um, and if you know, have seen our video with the local place, yeah, it's right it down is the road. like two doors down from the yep, local place. Sure is. So it's a, it's a very close by location and it's um, just a small family owned and it's a fantastic choice to make. So I would definitely come here again. Oh, As a matter sure. of fact, we're going to, we yeah, want to try the breakfast. breakfast. Yeah. Yep. We're going to try the Honduras breakfast. Yeah, I'm, I'm um, open for it. Yeah. And I would definitely, I would get the chimichangas too because I tried oh, his man, and they were really, so good. really good. So, yep. <laughs> so yeah. Well, anyway, thank you for watching and liking um, and subscribing. Yep, and uh, we appreciate it. And I guess uh, we will see you next time. Bye. Bye.